We're looking at another new function for 2019, and it can be found on the View tab, and it's called Advanced Display. Advanced Display can be used to show different aspects of your toolpath in different colors. So I'm going to click this button here to turn Advanced Display on, and notice some of the blue toolpath motion has changed colors. There's some red, uh, some green, some purple, and some brownish colors. So each of those colors are representing a particular type of toolpath motion now. So to determine what it is we're actually seeing based on the color, if we click on this bottom arrow here, this opens up our color selection menu. So the, from the motion type on the left, we can click on it and see the selected color for a given motion type. So our feed retract motions are this brownish color. So in your dynamic mill, those micro lift repositions will show up as this, this brown color. Entry motions are coming out as green. So entry motions could be stuff like our helical entry shown in this pocket here. Could also just be a uh, lead in and lead into this, this cut here, this contour. Exit motions are reddish. So when we're exiting a toolpath there, you can see a little red arc coming up and out of the toolpath. We also have an option here for drill tool diameter. Now there is no color associated with this, but what you're seeing here with this large dashed uh, yellow line around my drilled holes is the drill tool diameter that's being shown. So given a particular drilling operation, the size of the tool that's being used in that drilling operation will show up as a, di a diameter. So these larger holes here that are showing up, or larger circles, are from the fact that I'm using a larger spot drill on these holes. So that can sometimes be um, a little concerning. So that's maybe one that you might want to turn off, depends on your personal preference. Keep in mind with all of these, we can also change to new colors. We can also change the line style and we can also obviously change the thickness of those lines. And for the functions or for the displays that are actual points, we have a slider down here that can control the size of the points that we see. So we not only have control over the color of different motion types, we can also pick and choose which ones we want to actually see on our screen um, at the same time. So if I don't want to see my drill tool diameter showing up, I can simply uncheck that and those won't show on the screen anymore. Uh, also keep in mind you can do this with your rapid retracts. Maybe the rapids are making things a little bit busy and you can't see what's actually happening with your tool motion. Turning those off may make things a little bit easier for you to see uh, and determine if you're getting a good tool path or not. So finally, with the advanced display, we can not only access the ability to turn it on and off on the view tab, we can also access it on the toolpath manager. We can toggle the state of the advanced display. We can also access what's being shown. And then finally, the colors of the given motion types can be accessed from the pull down. It can also be accessed from the configuration menu. Once you expand the colors, the advanced display colors can be set in here as well.